longer. So I'll start by brushing Hendrix's face. Um, he's trying to climb on to the camera. It's really hard. Okay. So Kendrick, come on. It's time to brush your face. Kendrick, can I have a seat? Okay. Okay. Guys, guys. I want to turn my camera so you see what I want to show you now because um <laughs> these children they are driving me nuts so each time we arrange their room whenever I come in I always see this yes 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 I kid you not this is the room it's been turned upside down so guys um it's time for me to feed them their breakfast and i'll be giving them the little step cereal by asda yeah i got this cereal from asda and i'm always not um short of uh, breakfast ideas so this day i'm giving them this cereal so you can see that kendrick is all set waiting for his food and he eats quite well more than kendra well it depends sometimes um kendra stress me and or kendrick stress me so it depends so i'm done feeding the both of them so because um they are prince and princesses they do not drink water so i don't know so for me to make them drink water, I add a few drops of this Robinson drink, um, black currant. So when I add this, it's tasty and they actually drink more of this. So yeah. So I will now start preparing um, Kim's food. She will be having oats, yeah, quicker oats. So I'll just um, make or pour this in this plate or in the bowl. Then I'll be heating it up with the microwave. Yeah, so that's it. Then after feeding Kim, I'll have to look for something to eat. Yeah. I finished giving them their breakfast. So it's my turn now to have something to eat so i'm not having something much i'll just have this granola and mixed with cereal and some fiber so i'll just take a little from all of them and just have that as breakfast couple with this milk which i'll dilute with water so that's it so i'm not really doing much so here is it Come and join me. Yeah. So, I have cultivated cultivated this habit of eating while standing. So I don't know if I'm just the only one doing that. Like, because you see this, my mind will be telling me that don't sit down. Eat stand by eating so that you can eat fast. Because there's no time. There's no time. If you sit down now, these children will come and disturb you. They won't let you eat. So ever since I gave birth, especially when I gave birth to these twins, I've always, like most of the time, when I want to eat, if I'm home alone, I do stand to eat. So I, I, I hadn't sit down. So I think that's why, because I've been doing it right from when I gave birth to them here, I've just continued that habit of standing to eat. Yeah. Well, I think that's, one of those things like it will pass with time thank god they are growing up now like kim oh hey ho oh hey ho come sorry it's okay so this is me trying to peel off this egg which i have previously boiled and i'll be giving it to them so they can top up now that we're done having our breakfast, the next thing I'll do now is um is to clean the house, tidy the kitchen, tidy everywhere. Yeah, I know you will say I'm supposed to do that before 
we had our breakfast but you see i just do these things the way my body carries me the way my mind carries me the way, the way my mind tells me yeah so for now i think this is how for now this is how i've been managing this is how i've been cooking so they are having their eggs i'll just go start with the living room i'll just vacuum that place then after vacuuming the place i'll come down to the kitchen then i'll put on the tv for them to watch yeah so let me not bore you guys with my story or oh, i may not carry you guys along so but in a way i'll see you guys later At this point i just um uh, realized oh no okay i won't say realize because i was the one who used the milk yeah so um their milk is finished so there's no milk in the house anymore so i'm going to do a little or uh, mini grocery shopping and you can see it's just me and them i'm just at home with them so i'll just try and see if i can go along with them to get some milk and some other stuff in the shop close by yes yeah, so guys i don't dress finish like this so she will not see me i don't find like this i don't dress finish like this with my jean on top of my jean like this i will still use wrapper say back that girl because i just want to go sharp 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 and come back because i don't want kim to walk so i don't want kim to walk so i'm going to put kendra on my back now and kendrick and kim will be on the pram on the double pram yes so guys i'll see you guys when i come back and i might do a little um video in or how how do they say though how did they talk about? i will do small show show for road we gonna see how my area be like yeah so that's it see you guys later yeah come on enter back yay my baby girl yeah. my baby girl yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah 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 mama mama <laughs> What's the person they see? Sorry, sorry. She doesn't want to enter my back because she said she wants to be on the tram. 
so guys i'm back i actually wanted to buy the bigger um, milk but they don't have this is just one liter so we normally buy about um, the bigger the bigger one which is two liter so i ended up buying um two so making two liter and this fruit shoot for the children so they can just drink when they have finished having their lunch so i just picked a um, little stuff so guys there's this struggle like when you come to the uk if you don't have a car if you're not driving that's what i face that's what we face as a family here in the uk so but by the grace of god we're going to get over that phase very soon so you see when i want to go out to start thinking especially me especially when i'm at home alone with them i start thinking how do i go out with these children how do i carry them how do i sometimes if i even put um, one on my back you see people start looking at me and they start um laughing especially the white so um I, I, there was a day one called my attention and said i should teach her how to apply that sling guys they call them sling some people they call wrapper tie tie for back home so you see that's it so it's one of those things that you have to put into consideration when you are relocating um things i didn't know or we didn't know before we came here like getting international driver's license so that when you get here you can start driving if i had known i would have actually applied for that because i was driving back then in nigeria so well guys let me not bore you all too much with my story thank you for watching this video so far and please if you're the first time um, tuning into my channel please don't forget to turn on your subscription button is that what they call it okay subscribe to my channel and turn on your notification bell you will see one bell icon there so that when i post new videos you'll be the first to get notified all right guys so i'll be ending this vlog here see you guys in my next one bye